Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 3086, which is a super hard level, I can tell by the midnight blue stripes in the skull. We've got 35 moves to clear out 41 jelly, but the jelly is under, mostly under licorice twirls, with more licorice twirls set to come down. And the deal with licorice twirls is when I take out licorice, no new licorice is dispensed. And when I don't take out licorice, that's when it can drop down and infest. So I have to hopefully keep taking out licorice here while I've got some on the board and reach into these crevices. And then of course, if I can get that licorice lock removed, then I have access to a UFO, which will send out some wrapped candies. Notice now though, I'm at a point where I can't take out any licorice. There can be sometimes a one or a two turn delay. It's based on the level. And also I have to be, oops, hello. I have to be taking out uh, something under where the licorice would be dispensed in order for it to be dispensed. Uh, sometimes also, oh gosh, I could get to that directly. I'm gonna hold off and do this. Sometimes doing this isn't enough because it's using a special to target this remotely. See, look at that. I don't know if that was because I didn't take that out that one time or because I hit the uh, licorice remotely, but that's what can happen. Also, on some levels, the licorice just comes out one at a time, and sometimes it really streams out. And we got a streamer here, which is not pleasant. Okay, so now I've got this. If I can hold off and use it later, then it'll target where it's needed most but I don't know that I'm going to be able to wait to use it. I think I'm going to use it now and blast out some of this licorice. It didn't go high up at all. Oh, and then I've got ticking time bomb dispensers because, yeah, there wasn't enough bad stuff on the board for me, apparently. Oh. oh, I wonder if I could get a green through here. I was trying to get a red through here. This would be a really good move, except I've got licorice there, and it's not going to cut through it. I'm going to try this and just see if I can get green. Nope. But I did get some nice things to happen there. I cleared out some of those areas that are tough to get to. Taking out licorice. Now what should I choose? I've got these ticking time bombs. I'm going to take out licorice here. I could make another stripe, but it's not really going to do much more than this is going to do. This is better, taking out licorice. Taking out licorice. Here I can't take out licorice, but I can make another stripe. If I make another stripe and it gets set off, that's going to flood in. So I think I'm going to take out licorice here instead. Boy, I've got ticking time bombs that are set really low. I've got to do something with this. Okay. I need to set that off. So I need to stream an orange through here. It's not streaming. Come on, orange. Come on. There we go. Got it. <sighs> now, not only do I make a color bomb, but I take something out there. Uh, I think this is going to work well. I'm going to take this out, which takes out a lot of this stuff. Now I'm going to take out all purple from the board, and I'm hoping, oh, that orange bypassed. Get another color bomb. If I could get those two together. Right now I don't have any ticking time bombs that can destroy me. I could make this wrapped candy. It's not in a great spot. I'm going to do this so I can take out licorice. I'm going to do this to try to get these guys together. Well, this is at least going to take out the most prevalent color. Got it. Phew! All right. That is so tense. I think one of the things that helped me is I did use that uh, 
UFO as quickly as I could. But the other thing that helped me is my knowledge of how the licorice worked, even though it took a few beats to figure out how it exactly worked on this level, because it can have nuances. So if you have a good understanding of that licorice, you're likely to be more successful. Gotta stay ahead of those ticking time bombs too. That was a bit tenuous for me there for a bit, but I was able to get it done on my first playthrough. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. If you have questions or comments, please put those below, and I'm happy to respond as quickly as I can. And as always, thanks for watching.